Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. I'm making this video to clarify a doubt of a student as to when to write only the natural response equation or answer or when to write the complete response answer. So uh, very briefly I'll explain the difference. First of all let's see the source free RC circuit and the source free RC circuit uh, is that circuit which has no external source of excitation after t greater than zero. And in this case we just write the natural equation which is in this form v naught e raised to the power minus t over tau. So let's see this circuit. Now there is uh, no source present in this circuit so therefore this is a source free circuit and its answer will be something of this pattern. So 15 is V0 e raised to the power minus t over tau is 0 0.4 and similarly we can find write the equation for current. Here is another one. In this there is a source but at t equal to 0 this source is removed. So now this circuit is left. So again at t greater than 0 the circuit does not have any source and therefore this will be uh, the uh, transient response or the natural response equation. So the answer will be something like this. Now let's see in the circuit with source which we call the step response of our RC circuit. And in the step response uh, we write the complete response that is we write the natural response and also the forced response solution. Now the key point to understand is that in the circuit, like if you look here, this has two source, one is connected before t is equal to 0 or up to t is equal to 0, but after t greater than 0, the circuit, this circuit, this portion only, this still has a source. So any circuit which has a source left and that after t greater than 0 in that case we will write the complete response which will include the natural response which is called Vn or also called V transient and the forced response is called V final or also called V steady state. And so the answer will look something like this. So source is present that is the only key you have to keep in mind. And so the answer will be written in this form, so the V final or VSS and this term of the V naturally. Another example, here also you can see there are two sources, but at T greater than zero this will be open. So only this portion is left as shown here, this portion is left, but this also has a source present after T greater than zero and therefore this answer will also be written in this complete response form and so the answer will be something like this the V final or VSS and the transient response and exactly same logic goes for the uh, RL circuit so source free RL circuit you can see the source is removed at T greater than zero no source present here so only uh, this natural response format will follow Another example here also when this switch is closed this circuit is separated from this portion so we can say that after t greater than 0 this is the circuit which does not have a source in it and so this will also have a uh, equation of the natural equation only and when we go for the step response of RL circuit same logic and uh, if you see now here when this is open at t greater than 0 still the circuit has a source and so this here will follow the same technique that is the uh, steady state and the natural response part. And just one more example this switch is open at t is equal to 0 so this is the circuit which is left this also has a source after t greater than 0 and therefore this will also have the complete response equation written. I hope this gives you an understanding as to 
how to write the equations without any fear. Thank you.